Hey YouTube fam, I'm back with another video. And in this video, this involves a Tampa police officer. So uh, earlier in the week, Delvin White was um, fired as a school resource officer for using the N-word, yes. So his um, body camera was, um, has caught, he was caught um, on his body camera using that word. Um, in one instance, he was having a conversation with his wife. Another, he was arresting someone and he was saying something like, you're gonna go to jail now. And then he uses the N word. Now, he says that the word is being used as, um, uh, now he's a black resource officer, just so you know, and he is being fired for violating that po discrimination policy. And he said it's a word that um, he used kind of like a term of a term of endearment, not like the same way a white person would use the word where they have the ER at the end of it. Now, if another group were to use that same word with the term of endearment, hey, what's up, my? How would you feel about it? I don't know. Let's take a look. What's up, my nigga? What did you just say? What's up, my nigga? Now, we see what happens when you use that term. Or even if another group uses that term. And I don't like the idea of the fact that we use that term and we say it's a term of endearment or we're taking back that name because what other group uses a racial slur and they use it as a way of, as a term of endearment to one another. If you water it down, other people are gonna use the term and then say, well, it's so watered down that it doesn't have the same significance as it once did when it was used, you know, during civil rights era or during slavery. But the term should not be used even by us. It just shouldn't. It's not a term that, that should be in our vocabulary at all because if we want america to stop using it we have to stop using it. if we want anyone globally to use it to not use it because it's really um and it's an anti-black term so no one should be using that term and especially police officers given the fact that we're talking about police brutality and misconduct no one should be using it especially in trying to arrest a suspect like literally the same way he used it would be the same way um, a white police officer would use it and we would call it racist. And we there would be an outcry. So I'm not an advocate for it, but um, tell me your thoughts. So I'm gonna go ahead and roll that clip and then uh, I'll end it there and comment, subscribe, and uh, tell me, do you think he should have been fired? Um, he does have, his, um, I think the benevolent team or the um, the union that he has is trying to, um, you know, say that he should not be fired over it. Um, but if they set that precedent, then that means they would have to be, it would have to be an equal opportunity. That means everyone gets the opportunity to use that word without being fired. So tell me your thoughts in regards to him being fired. Do you think he can say it because he's black? Do you think it's wrong that he said that that he um, is being fired or that he should just be reprimanded um, or if it's just only should be linked to officers who are non-black? A black resource officer at Tampa High School has now been fired after police say a random audit of his body worn camera captured him using the N word multiple times. Officer Delvin White told his supervisor he did not mean for the word to be derogatory and was using it as a means of shared culture and experiences among the African American community. Investigators say he was recorded saying the word on the phone while driving home from an off duty assignment, again while talking on the phone with his wife, and twice while arresting someone for trespassing. Tampa's police chief says officers are held to a higher standard and such incidents negatively impact the entire profession. Katie Johnston for CBSMiami.com.